In the 2016 presidential campaign, immigration became a big issue. One proposal was to build a wall at the Mexican border, but immigration isn't that simple. About three quarters of today's immigrants come to the U.S. legally on permanent visas. So about one in four are not authorized to be here. Of that group, about 40% were admitted legally. They were on temporary visas for things like work and travel. They became undocumented when their visas expired and they stayed. In 2015, most of these immigrants came from Canada, more than double than Mexico, followed by Brazil, then Germany. So is a wall even necessary? Since the recession, the number of unauthorized immigrants from Mexico has declined. From 2007 to 2014, that number decreased by 20%, or about 1 million immigrants. Mexicans have actually been going south, leaving the United States rather than coming north. The number of people in Mexico with friends or family in the U.S. is also going down, which could continue that trend. Although a wall does seem simple, immigration is too complicated for simple solutions.